Well, good afternoon, everybody. Here we are right up in the northeast of England. This is going to be probably our longest trip of the season, or what's left of it now. We have come all the way up to the northeast of Hartley Pools. In the background there, you saw the uh, cranes. We're in real industrial area up here. That is the docks straight across from us in the distance. Behind the docks, of course, we've got the North Sea. And so things are pretty cold up here, as, of course, they are at Blundell Park on many an occasion. Hartlepool United, who had a fine win on uh, Boxing Day, beating Scarborough 4-1. And we'll quickly run through the Hartlepool side first here. And out to the left side well again. This is Dalton. He's causing some trouble. Still going through the middle. Chance on. 1-0. McDermott didn't get a challenge in. Dalton persevered, went on his way, and Hartley Pools go 1 0 up, and that was a fine strike by Dalton. Still Olsen, ball coming in now, he's had a good looking cross. Man turns. It was Allen coming in, Paul Reese did very well to spread himself there. Low. Alan McKinnon forward again still there still there edge of the box shot coming in well wide but Town standing off the men here I'm afraid and that in actual fact has gone for a throw in Holtson down the line flicked on by Baker away by Town and another throw to Hartley Pools Allen. Oh, good ball inside. Finds top lane. Ball forward again. Through. 2-0. It's Dalton again. And the town defence carved apart. 2-0 now to Hartlepool. Alexander looking to turn, which he does. Shot coming in just over the top. Corner kick given. Stevenson dragging his man around, allowed to play on. Then comes Lever with a good header. Childs. Could line up a shot, does do. Screaming one just over the crossbar. Still McKinnon. And number nine, Reese is going to have a talking to. In actual fact, probably going to get a booking, I think, for his second sloppy challenge. Mr Midgley just telling him that's the second time he's done it, he's got to cut it out. I think it's fair to say Tony Reese uh, lucky to escape with just a, a tongue lashing. Certainly be in the book for his uh, next defence, I reckon. Hartley pulled to slam it into the middle. Dalton, long ball in, falls to the far post. 3-0. Sloppy marking once again. Hartlepool United thrash the loose ball into the top of the net. Paul Reese very unhappy, and the town defence arguing amongst themselves now. Where Charles is square of him, ball through the middle. Keith Alexander though being pulled around and a free kick for town. Stevenson, who got uh, a bit of a rap uh, earlier on there on the edge of the box, limps off to be replaced by Watson. Ball is not square. Childs drives in. Chance on now. Reese pulls one back. Hartley Pool players surely looking for offside. Oh, we got there first. Still there, the ball not out of play. Dalton trying to go round his man, that almost does do. Ball comes back to McKinnon. Chance for him to get the cross in. Checks. Dalton is still there in support if he wants him. Still McKinnon. Town yet to get the tackle in. Dalton. Cross coming in. Not a bad one. Flicked on. And that's an excellent goal by Allen. Lovely goal flicked on at the near post. And it really all came about through Grimsby not making the challenge on the man down here on the left wing position, Dalton and McKinnon. 
free kick given. McDermott will take the free kick. Alexander there, flicks on. Yep, 4 2. Goal at the other end under similar circumstances. It was a super header again by Keith Alexander. Very similar to the Hartlepool goal before it. A good free kick by John McDermott. Found the header, big Keith Alexander. And he did exactly the same.